water logging an agricultural land is said to be waterlogged when the soil pores within the root zone of the crops are fully saturated to such an extent that natural air circulation within the soil pores is completely cut off the land may be considered as waterlogged if the water table is within 1.5 meter to 2.1 meter below the ground surface causes of waterlogged over an intensive irrigation seepage from adjoining higher land and canal system impervious obstruction under the surface inadequate surface drainage obstruction of natural drainage excessive rainfall submerges due to flood incorrect method of cultivation and irrigation construction of water reservoir effects of water logging creation of anaerobic condition near the roots of plant excess of moisture prevents circulation of air this will destroy the bacteria which can survive only in aerobic condition so there will be lack of chemical nutrients required for plants which reduces yield of crops difficulty in cultivation growth of unwanted plants and grass reduction in maturity period due to water logging crop matures untimely and yield will be less than expected than normal yield salinity due to upward movement of water the harmful salts inside the earth are sifted to the surface and soil becomes saturated with salt which reduces the fertility of soil lowering the temperature of soil increase the formation of insects and mosquitoes prevention of water logging lining of canal reducing intensity of irrigation or providing controlled irrigation method introducing crop rotation certain crops require more water and some require less water if a field is always introduced with crops requiring more water the chances of water logging is more to avoid this high water requiring crops should be followed by less water requiring crops for example rice may be followed by wheat and wheat may be followed by other dry crops proper use of water and providing an effective drainage system